working with denominators, find the lowest common denominator of 3x over 10 and 2y over 15. So we're looking at 10 and 15, and again, um, this is just revision, you have done this previously. Two methods, the first method is if you have small numbers, the lowest common denominator, we have 10 and 15, and what we do is we start the smallest number, and we just write multiples of, or the biggest number, and we just write multiples of them until we see that 10 can divide into that. So 15, um, 10 doesn't go to 15. So 15 times 2 is 30. 10 can go into 30. All right, 10 can go into 30 because it's 10, 20, 30. So 30 is the lowest common multiple. So lowest common multiple, sorry, lowest common denominator equals 30. That's all you had to do there. For B, if we look at B, they say convert 2x over 7 to an equivalent fraction with a denominator of 21. So we want to say this equals something over 21. So all I'm going to ask myself is, what I did to 7 to get to 21? I had to multiply it by 3. You also could have said, what is 21 divided by 7? And the answer would have been 3. So I'm going to multiply that by 3. So to multiply the denominator, I also have to multiply the numerator. And remember why? Because now I'm multiplying by 1, and that's why I get an equivalent fraction. 2x times 3 equals 6x, and that will be my equivalent fraction.